Hey, if you have a printing problem where you are trying to print something and like images suddenly become washed out or like transparent background images suddenly turn black, here's the solution. Long and short of it, the reason why this happens is because the manufacturers suck. They made a PostScript driver that has some problems and they pushed it out and leave it to the open source community, IPP everywhere to fix it. If you've ever used the print option with your Android device or with your iDevice, like iOS, iPhone, all those, then you're using IPP everywhere already. On Mac OS and Linux, they use IPP everywhere by default. Like your AirPrint thing on Mac OS, that is IPP. It finds the AirPrint port and then it just connects to it. And it's like, yeah, let's use this. But on Windows and on certain distributions of Linux that don't automatically find and assign printers, um, you have to add the URL manually. And the way that you get that URL, by the way, this right here is the profile of your printer. And this is mine. Uh, just type in HTTP colon forward slash forward slash the printer's IPv4 address and then a full colon and the port 631. That's the IPP port. And then search for IPP. And that right there is your URI for your uh, printer for printing over IPP and IPPS. Uh, IPPS is just like an encrypted version of it. You don't have to do anything extra. You can use either or, it doesn't really matter. In your add a printer option, whether you're in Linux or in Windows, there is an option to manually add the printer. And there's a spot inside of there where you can specify the, the address of it and you can just use the IPP address. That's where you put that URI in and then you're off to the races. I had completely forgotten about this problem until I uh, went to create some print media that I'm gonna be handing out. And yeah, that uh, I had to rack my old technician brain to remember what the solution to the problem was. I originally found this problem on Windows uh, whenever it was just like, well, why is this happening? Why is this a problem? You would think that these multi-billion dollar corporations that make these products would, you know, test them really, really thoroughly. But uh, yeah.